Alright, this is Trotter Yu-Gi-Oh! here with a dollar binder update. It, I'm not really doing videos anymore, just because I got really busy with school, I don't have a whole lot of time. But I did get a request to do a dollar binder update, so I figured I could go ahead and do that for people. Um, I haven't done one of these in a long time because people weren't really buying from them, so it wasn't really worth the time put into making it. But I did get a request, so I'm going to go ahead and make another one. And I want to say that this mon the monster one has improved quite a bit. Rules are pretty much the same as always. If you have any questions, just ask. Every card is mint to near mint. If I notice that there's something wrong with a card that you want, I will let you know. Um, I don't send first. I've done over 100 completed trades on YouTube with trade proofs. I have 200 plus sales on eBay. I have 500 plus sales on TCG Player. I'm on the Omega Trusted Traders list on Zodiac. I've done absolutely hundreds of trades and sales through Palringo. So you get the idea. Every card is $1. I ask that you buy at least two cards at a time just to make shipping worthwhile for me. Um, if you don't want to message me on YouTube, my Skype will be in the description below, or if you're on Palringo, which is where most people who buy stuff from these are, just let me know. And there's lots of different ways to get a hold of me. If you have any questions, just leave a comment below. The Spell and Trap binder is what I would say significantly worse than the Monster binder, just with like bad cards, but there's not a whole lot of Spell and Traps that are in the dollar range that people actually need. So if you want anything from here, let me know, that's great, but I'm probably going to discontinue this specific binder pretty soon, just because I have other uses for the actual Monster binder that I'd rather use it for. And like I said, this one kind of sucks. Um, I strongly prefer that you send on PayPal. I will take concealed cash, but I've had a lot of issues in the past with concealed cash either not arriving or not being in the right amount. And I'm just stuck with the cards and I can't sell the cards because the guy might pay. But it's just a bad situation for everyone involved. PayPal is easier, PayPal is safer. Um, I do ask that you send PayPal gift unless you're buying an absolute ton of stuff and you just want the extra security. But if you're sending PayPal gift for a $2 order, this is just like sending first to me. And as I said earlier, you should be pretty comfortable doing that. Um, if you have any other questions, just let me know. If you want anything, just send me what you're interested in. I'll let you know if I still have it. And peace out, YouTube.